hello guys welcome back to our channel it's me anil and today i'm going to download and install visual studio to run 2022 so first of all open your any browser which you have then search for visual studio download here we'll going to get the first official link from the microsoft open it in new tab then here we can see download of visual studio that is community professional enterprise the free one is that is community so we'll go for it just click on it download and then it will going to start download the execution file open it then it will going to ask you one um, pop-up click on yes then it will going to download uh, it will going to start the download of installer file of visual studio so just click on continue it will take some second okay so it's done almost now here we need to select the template uh, which we want here the first one that is asp.net revolution the second one is .net desktop application okay so let's close this and expand the second one and in that like uh, we are if you want to create a project in web form then select this check boxes which i am doing here three checkbox we need to check here okay this is the optional optional checkbox like if you want uh, to create for this web form project then click on next and it will going to start the downloading part here this will take some time to get download till then you can go for a food or can have a tea just kidding okay but it will definitely going to take some time maybe half an hour based on your internet connection and internet connection speed and then the other one your system performance okay so like i have forwarded this uh, video in 8x okay so let's see how many time like how much time it will take okay so it's almost uh, going to complete okay so installation is done here you can see uh, done installing okay and now click on ok and close this one visual studio installer and here we can go for like this one uh, dark mode also okay so if you want then close this visual studio installer and search for this one visual studio which is uh, which we just have downloaded okay just search for it here uh, visual studio 2022 okay click on it it will going to get opened here So first of all you need to go uh, get sign in here in this so click on sign in need to enter your uh, account okay so like if you don't have you can go for create a new one and like then come back here for sign in okay enter your uh, like email address here then click on next enter your password sign in
okay so our sign in has been done here successfully so now we need to create a new project so that we can check whether like a download uh, installation has been completed or not okay so let's create a new project here We'll select here uh, the template for like project we are going to create so we are going to create here one web, web application project uh, which is in web form so we'll uh, search for web and go for dotnet framework in that is dot revolution select it uh, there is other other uh, like framework also like a uh, uh, item template we can use here for creating project but we are using here dotnet framework uh, and here that is uh, we can change here the project name as well as the project location and selecting some other uh, different location uh, in this like i will going to create a new folder or just on this edge and this drive that's it okay so we can change the uh, uh, like uh, this one framework also the latest latest one that is this one okay so click on create we need to uh, like select here web form it will going to uh, create some code for uh, for us like basic code uh, design like it will going to uh, already have in that project so we will like we need the so we, we can check that whether that uh, like auto generate code is like uh, working or not okay just we are going to just confirm it okay nothing else but uh, but still uh, like uh, the download uh, installation is like uh, done successfully no error or problem in that like uh, you can find but still like uh, we are going to check here by creating one project here okay so it will take some time to get uh, create here okay so it's created it takes some time to get loaded okay so let's close this one and you can see all the files are like uh, created here uh, the the main file that is the default one let's open here and run this project okay so we have all the files uh, which is a default or a basic uh, template uh, have in this project okay so let's see how it will going to appear in the browser okay so our project has been here like uh, displays here in the browser that means uh, like our installation is successfully so like uh, thank you for watching here like uh, we'll meet in some other videos